Sergeant Brandon White says some cases are difficult to solve. Evidence, much less confessions, hard to come by. But on Monday, a Williamsburg woman came to the fire department after she had received an unusual voicemail and asked for help. I stopped by and she informed me that um, on her message, someone had mistakenly dialed her phone and claimed to have shot someone. The voicemail was of a man talking about a shooting that happened in Leslie County that was still under investigation. The caller said he was the shooter. He dials the number by mistake and the lady didn't answer the phone and he left a voice message and he identified himself and identified who the person he shot. A sheriff's deputy in Leslie County is currently investigating this. I am told that the shooting happened Sunday. The victim was shot in the foot. There on the phone, a confession, albeit left for the wrong person, which could turn into easy evidence for police. Police say such calls aren't that rare. In fact, Sergeant White says some people have accidentally called him thinking he was someone else. It has happened. I, one time I, in fact, had, had someone mistakenly call me and, uh, and wanted to try to sell some drugs. A criminal's mistake making it easier for police. In Whitley County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT.